What's up guys, it's the Vegeta SSG2 back with another video and in today's video is going to be a topic about Dragon Ball Super episode 78. So if you guys don't want to be spoiled, I highly, I highly suggest you guys leave this video because there will be spoilers here. In my channel there are spoilers, so if you guys didn't know that my channel contains spoilers, well there is spoilers in my channel. So if you guys didn't know that, now you know. So let's begin by talking about the summary for it. Dragon Ball Super episode 78. The gods of each universe are aghast. You'll be obliterated if you lose at the Tournament of Power, February 12th. So this episode will begin on February 12th after episode 77. So let's continue reading. Starting up a match with the Omni King in attendance, Goku's allies are... Goku looks for two allies for the match against Universe 9 that the Omni King will be watching. First he scouts out Gohan who's now a scholar but Gohan's hesitant to agree. Omni King this week. Obliterating the losing universes, the tournament of power has a fearsome rule. When a universe loses, it is obliterated without a trace by the Omni King's power. How does Goku react to this shocking situation? So it looks like Universe 7 will be going against Universe 9. And you know, we have no idea how the Universe 9 members look like yet. I mean, the Gods of Destruction, we don't know which universes they are in, and if it's the Clown God of Destruction that's from Universe 9, that will be pretty interesting, but I don't think it's from Universe 9, I think it's somebody else. So, um, I'm really looking forward to this because, for one thing, Goku, he's the one that prepared, like, he's the one that asked the Omni King to prepare this tournament, so, like... All the hate is gonna be on Goku if the universe, if one of the universes lose, because Goku was the one that to ask Omni King to prepare for the tournament. Now I know Goku's like pretty shocked because the Omni King said he is gonna destroy the universe that loses, and Goku feels so bad right now because I think Goku's gonna feel so bad because if the other universes lose, and they're all gonna blame it on Goku for telling the Omni King to prepare the tournament. So everybody's gonna be telling. Everybody's going to be saying it's Goku's fault. So, um, hopefully Universe 7 wins because if Universe 7 lose, you know, there's no more Dragon Ball Super as I said in my previous videos because, you know, you got 12 universes and if Universe 7 is the one that goes down, it wouldn't make sense because if Universe 7 loses, where are the main cast for the Dragon Ball Super? Like, where are they? So, I know that Universe 7 are not going to die. Like, if they do die, um, they will get resurrected back i believe and you know i i'm really looking forward to this tournament and i think this tournament is going to be a very long arc i feel like this arc is going to be extremely long and i'm not going to be surprised by that because we got 120 fighters participating in this tournament and we get to see the first match between universe 7 versus universe 9 so the the team members that's going to participate in universe 7 i think we saw that in the trailer with goku vegeta and krillin so far in universe 7 we've only seen goku vegeta and krillin fighting in that trailer so i do think the first match is going to be goku krillin and vegeta versus the girl that looked like majin buu the wolf and female broly so i do think goku vegeta and krillin are going to go go up against those three in the first match i mean if it's not the first match it could be the second match or whenever it starts so do i think all three of them are from universe 9 i don't think female broly's from universe 9 because if you guys look at female broly she has the belt the same belt as kaba so she's definitely from universe 6 i mean if she's not from universe 6 then i'm gonna be a little bit confused because her belt it's the same thing as Kaba. If you guys look closely, it's the same thing. So she has to be from Universe 6. As for the wolf and the Majin Buu look, that looks like a girl, um, I do think they're from Universe 9. And if female Broly's from Universe 9, I would not want to know like how is she even there because, as I said, she's a Saiyan. And so far, we only know that Saiyans are from Universe 6 and 7 because Universe 7 is like the opposite of Universe 6 the universe 6 so i mean it's not the opposite but it's like the same thing but it's different like you know how beerus and champa are like different they're like the same but champa's like the fatter version of beerus so i do think female broly is from universe 6 so let me know in the comment section below if you guys are hyped for this upcoming dragon ball super episode episode 78 and I will be doing another video talking about more spoilers for Dragon Ball Super when they come. So 
I hope you guys have a great day and please turn on the notifications for my channel so you guys never miss a video. And yeah guys, that's basically it. If you guys have any questions, please comment down below and I'll see you guys later. Peace.